Hello everybody, it's Nick here, and I just gotta say, feeling, you know, being 19 is just totally awesome. Um, so far, none of my parts are aching, so that's good. Um, today, I had probably one of the best days in my life, besides meeting Alice in Chains. That and going to Vegas are a tie um, for the best day of my life. But today, I had like a really fucking awesome day with my father. Um, we went down to the Ivers on the waterfront. And uh, it was just loads of fun. And then uh, it was kind of hard to eat with all the seagulls screaming. So there were a couple pigeons there. I fed them a couple fries. It was just funny watching them eat them, you know. Because um, my grandfather used to raise pigeons and, like, have them, like, race and stuff. It was pretty cool. Um, unfortunately, I never got to experience that because, you know, I wasn't with my grandfather when he was doing that. But uh, my dad was. And... So, yeah, it was, an, it was an awesome day spending time with my dad. Um, you know, we had loads of fun. We went to the curiosity shop, too. Looked at a few things, which, um, had a good time there, overall. Um, now, of course, who am I to not go to a game store on my birthday? I picked up a couple games. One is a crappy game, but one is a really awesome game. Now, the first game, I did a little questionnaire on my, uh, Facebook asking, well, should I get... I was asking between, you know, these two Capcom titles, should I get either Gargoyle's Quest 2 or Destiny of an Emperor? Well, the game I got was Gargoyle's Quest 2. This was $40, so it was not a cheap game, but my dad was nice enough to, you know, buy both these games. So we spent fucking $60 on games, so I really appreciate it, you know. So... Um, anyways, I saw this at the game store, like, last month, and it's like, oh, they're not going to have it when I come back to get it, but they did, so that's awesome. Um, now I just got to test it out. And usually I don't like RPG games, but this one is also an action game, too, so, I mean, I kind of like it. Now, the second game I got that, you know, I said was crap is Mario is Missing. Now, if I just got Mario's Time Machine, then I, I think I'd have the complete Radical Entertainment Collection. Um... Now, I paid 20 bucks for this one, or my dad paid 20 bucks for this one. So, this was, um, now, honestly, I don't think it's as bad of a game as people say it is. I can see why people don't like it. You know, it, it's like the Archfiend. I mean, it's not as, they're not as bad as people say they are, but I can see totally why people don't like the games. And, of course, you know, this one's no exception. I mean, it, of course, not the best game on earth. But it was pretty good. Besides, they're the makers of one of my favorite NES games, Wayne's World. And I know some people think I'm crazy for that, but um, it's the truth. Now, uh, shit, where, where is it? Uh, okay, well, it's somewhere around here. But I also have Terminator 1, which was also by Radical Entertainment. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to enjoy these games, I'm sure. Um... Of course, you know, Gargoyle's Quest 2, I'm probably going to enjoy a little bit more than this one. But this one's got a good soundtrack, and, you know, that's good enough for me, you know. And besides, you know, the controls are good, the graphics are good, you know, so nothing wrong with that. So overall, you know, good pickups today. Yeah, I only got two games, but they're two fucking awesome games that make up for like a thousand games. So I'm going to go try these out, so wish me luck. I'm sure they're going to work, but I mean, you never know. So, again, thank you guys so much. Um, everybody on Facebook who's given me birthday wishes and everyone who's told me happy birthday, I honestly appreciate your kind words. And, you know, I so far, yes, I had a very good day. And, and also, it, it was just the perfect day. Now, I woke up today and it was cloudy. And it's like, oh, man, you know, I was hoping it would be sunny. And, you know, when I was down see, you know, downtown with my dad, you know, the clouds opened up, so it's like, you know, and it was all sunny, so it's like, yay, it was a nice day. I even took a picture of myself, I might use it as a profile picture, but because of the sun's reflection stuff, it's kind of hard to see my face, but at least I'm kind of cracking a smile in there. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just not one to smile and when I'm taking pictures of myself, so, you know, when I'm taking videos of myself, that's a different story, but I don't know. Just a little thing with me, I guess. I don't know. So anyways, thank you so much, guys. I honestly appreciate it. And um, on another note, I didn't know this until my aunt brought it up to me, but it's also Joan Rivers' birthday today, so I'm not really familiar with her. I mean, I know who she is, but I'm just not, you know, I don't really pay attention to her. So 
and something I always remember is from uh, the game Soul Calibur 2, the character I think, I'm pretty sure if I remember right, his name is Mitsurugi. Um, he was, it says he was born on June 8th too, so I'll tell you, it's awesome to be born in the summer, you know, I, th I think it is. So, thank you guys again for the millionth time. You have no idea, you know, I can't express my gratitude enough. And I'm hoping to talk to you guys all later. So, thanks for watching and peace out.